With Windows 10 support officially ending on October 14, 2025, Microsoft will no longer ship security updates or technical support for that operating system. At the same time, a lot of older PCs can't upgrade to Windows 11 because of strict hardware requirements, but you don't have to toss those devices. Instead of buying a new PC, you can give your old machine a second life by installing Zorin OS. Zorin is a polished, user-friendly Linux distribution built to be fast, secure and familiar for people coming from Windows or Mac OS. It's designed to run well on older or low-end hardware. You can also run Android apps on it, but it takes a little extra setup. So today I'm going to show you step-by-step -step how to download Zorin OS, make a bootable USB and install it on your PC or laptop even if it's an older machine. So before we start, like this video and subscribe to support my small channel. Let's get started. First, open your browser and search for Zorin OS. Then go to the official site. Here, Click on Download button. Choose the edition you want. There's a paid pro version if you want extra features, but the free edition works great for most users. Click the Download button and save the ISO file. The file is around 3.5 gigabytes, so it may take a while, depending on your internet speed. Now we will download a free tool called Rufus. It's a small trusted tool for making bootable USB drives. Download the latest release. It doesn't need installation, you just run the executable. Open your Downloads folder when both files are downloaded. Open Rufus. Now, plug in a USB flash drive that should be 8 GB or larger. Rufus should detect the drive automatically. Under Boot Selection, click Select and pick the Zorin OS ISO you downloaded. Next, choose the Partition Scheme. To check that, search System Information on Windows search bar and open it. Here, look for BIOS mode. If your PC uses UEFI, pick GPT. If it uses Legacy, pick MBR. After selecting the correct partition style, leave the other settings at their defaults and click Start. Rufus will warn you that it will format the USB. Accept the warnings and let it finish. When it's done, close Rufus. Now our bootable USB is ready. To install Zorin OS, Keep the USB plugged in and restart the PC. Press your machine's boot menu key as the logo appears. It depends on your manufacturer. From the boot menu, choose the USB device and press Enter. Now choose Try or Install Zorin OS. Go with Install option because we are installing it on our hard drive. Follow the on-screen prompts. Choose the installation language, keyboard layout and start installation. The installer will copy files and configure the system. This can take several minutes. When the process finishes, Reboot and remove the USB when prompted. When PC restarts, it will directly boot into Zorin OS. 
If you want Android apps, follow Zorin's instructions for enabling Android support after installation on Zorin's help pages or any YouTube video. That's it. Your PC is now running Zorin OS. If this guide helped, please like the video and subscribe to my channel. If you run into any issues or have questions, drop a comment and I'll help you out. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.